the focus on the on the Federal Reserve itself uh, for a moment in that I wonder, you know, what percentage of the people know that the Federal Reserve is not really a part of the government, a privately owned corporation, and who owns that, you know, the Federal Reserve? Well, do you have a comment on that? Well, I think very few people understand how it works uh, because the members of Congress weren't uh, really mu uh, very much aware of it. But I think it's a little bit worse than just saying it's private. You know, if it were just private, uh, they'd have to live within the laws of the land Open of the fraud, screen. and they would have to uh, be a public corporation. And, you know, if Open there's books. a public corporation, you have a right to know what your corporation is doing if you own stock. And be here, audited. Here yeah. it's secret, but where do they get their power? Is it the power of the marketplace that creates this corporation? No, they, in addition to being very secretive, have their authorization, their creation from government. So the government creates them and they create a special thing. So it's much worse than just being a private corporation. It is a very secretive, private, government-ordained corporation that has the power to counterfeit money. So it's very, very unique and much worse than just being private. It's the secrecy of it and the power that it gets through government legislation that makes it so evil. Now, you were the ranking Republican on the House Banking Committee for a while. On House one of the subcommittees, subcommittees, but not on the entire committee. And do I understand correctly that members of Congress are, can't even go to the Fed meetings? That's right. I was very interested in the issue, and I was on three subcommittees, two being on coinage and domestic monetary policy subcommittee, but I could not go to a meeting. I couldn't get an audit. I couldn't even check the books, and they're the ones who create the money. Uh, yet I was, I felt like I was elected to be responsible to the people, and I would be inquisitive and looking into these things. Their attitude is, when you need to know, or when the people need to know, we'll tell you. They're in charge, and we're just on the outside looking in, rather than the people being in charge of the government, sending me or somebody else as their congressman to control the bureaucrats. But it's turned upside down. They have control. And they allow us to know what we want and what they think we should know.